What's up, Capricorn? Welcome to Ocean Tarot Garden. Thank you for being a garden babe. We are about to see what spirit has to say to you guys. What the message is for right now. I'm hearing like this is a message for the fathers. Okay, so this could be like a Capricorn father or somebody who has a Capricorn as a father or a baby father. That's what I'm hearing. <clears throat> we have the Emperor, the Page of Wands, and the Death and the Death card here. And the first thing that I'm hearing is that there's somebody who's not standing up and being are doing as much as they need to be doing for a child here. Um, and it's just like, you need to see things. You need to really focus on what's important and what's not important because all I'm hearing is like, you pick and choose when to be a father or when you feel like it's most important to be a father. And it's just like, are you truly involved? Are you just doing the bare minimum right now? Or somebody feels like you're doing the bare minimum right now. I feel like you need to be opening your child's eyes. Like this is the prime time to be showing them the important things of life. Okay. This is when they need you the most. Okay. We have the 10 of swords here. So somebody could be feeling like you're a deadbeat. Somebody could be feeling like somebody's father or a Capricorn. I don't know. Some, some father here is a deadbeat. Okay. They feel like they're deadbeat and somebody's just tired and, and just want to put an end to something here. I'm also hearing like your child is your child could be very young if you do have like an adolescent or something. And it's more so of this is the most impressionable time to build this connection or the most impressionable time to help mold your child into not who you want them to be, but helping them like, I don't know how to put it. It's like a lot of things going on in the world right now. And this is the time that you need to be making the impression on your child and not allowing social media influences and other things like that to influence your child. And I feel like a lot of you guys are needing to come in because we do know the importance of the masculine energy in a child's life. And I do feel like things are needing to take a change, okay? It's not just come in and exit whenever you want to. I'm hearing like a free-flowing father here, okay? However, we all know that children just love their parents no matter, you know, what. Like they might not be as present, but when they see them, they feel like their parent is everything, I'm just feeling like more time is needing to be spent uh, with this child. Are you choosing other things over your children right now, Capricorn? Yes. I'm honestly getting like somebody is feeling like they're always on the move or always have so much to do. But in reality, it's just like that stuff is really not as important as your home front. I do feel spirit asking you to take time to really just sit back and recollect and see the importance of family, your children and being there and assisting and giving a constant hand, not a, um, every now and then type of hand into this child's life. With this death card and this rebirth card, it's just like this This child is going to mimic your actions, is going to mimic and remember the effort that you put into them. Also, remember that it's just like the seeds that you plant and the time that you spend and the core memories that you create is what's going to help build this child, okay? There's somebody out there who needs a break. There, I'm feeling like this is a woman who needs a break. All right. She just is constantly going. 
okay uh you could be working night or just feels like they have long nights this person just wants some alone time some solitude some time to think this person also wants to be appreciated as well okay i'm also feeling outside of this child's energy here there is somebody here who is recovering from some kind of some kind of pain okay um Somebody is trying to rebuild themselves, and I feel like they can be kind of distanced as well. I would say give them offerings, show them love and appreciation during this time. Make sure that you're showing love and appreciation because somebody needs it. This could be you as well, Capricorn. Somebody wants to know that their efforts doesn't go unnoticed. Tell me more about Capricorn. We have six on the clock, which just means somebody needs to be given appreciation. Somebody needs to be shown. Six right now, okay? They need an offering, like I said before. So you could be seeing sixes a lot. Ace of Pentacles. and the sixes are popping out so you could be seeing a lot of sixes okay 66 is a number that you need to look up as well we have the ace of pentacles strength card six of cups and the hair fan i feel like the strength card has popped out in everybody's reading here all right somebody's just wanting some kind of peace Somebody is wanting somebody. I'm also hearing like there could be like this love commitment that's coming in, or like I said, this could be a commitment that has that's based off of a child. Um, y'all having a child together or something like that. But I'm also hearing if there's a love offering here, somebody wants you to come in and be their peace. They need the fem they need somebody to balance the feminine or the masculinity in them or assist them in balancing. They need to they need to be nurtured back into some kind of feminine energy is what I'm hearing as well. Like I said, give offerings and gifts. Somebody wants some kind of commitment as well. Somebody wants a leader, somebody to step forward um, and just do things and not have to ask for them. Uh, yeah. Somebody needs to be more flexible with the time that they have with an individual or a child, okay? You need to be, like I said, it's very, something is giving like impressionable. Like this is, this is what you need to be giving. Spending more quality time with somebody. Pouring into them, okay? This is the time that they need to be learning with you and growing with you. Don't risk this friendship or the, I mean, don't risk this relationship, friendship or this relationship with your child based off of feeling like you always have to go or you always have something to do. Okay. There is definitely a change that needs to take place here and some things that are about to come to light. I'm feeling like a discovery. Yeah. There's somebody here who is like, when they're around you, they're happy. And once you leave, like y'all, like you're not around, like y'all not in the same home of some sort or something like that. And it's just like, when y'all not around, this person is very, very sad and emotional. And this could be in secrecy, like nobody knows or somebody knows that they're not telling you how this person acts because you're not there. They're longing for your presence. They could be going through a lot. Back and forth with emotions, having good days and bad days. And I feel like because you're not around, it's causing them to act out. 
do you do have this queen of pentacles which is just giving me this mother figure here okay so this mother can be an earth sign or could be the mother of the child of an earth sign here the two of swords and i feel like the mother could just be like I feel like turning a blind eye. There's somebody here who's turning a blind eye or not even noticing the the effects that it's having on the child. But it's definitely a conversation or they're like beating themselves up about really having this conversation to move forward. But it needs to happen here. There's a child that needs to be nurtured. Definitely a child here who needs to be nurtured here. All right. So I just feel like this message is for Capricorn to really pay attention to what's important, to stop putting everything in front of this child or making this child feel like you can pick and choose when to feel like they're important and when they're not. Uh, that's just the energy that I'm getting. It's just simple and plain as that. And that's just the reading that I have for you, Capricorn.